Alright, show on, show on. Giving all praises and honor and glory that is due to you. How about Shimmy Al Shai? By Shim Rakakadash. Double loss to the elves and the apostles of greatness, known who taught me is true. And double side taste to all your Akin, the men that are prophesying the name throughout the four winds of this earth, pushing the truth with our righteousness and sincerity. Show on to your brothers and to the Aqua, the feasts, instead of listening and learning. To you, I say show on. Coming back at you with another lesson through the spirit and prayer, Yah, by Shim Al Shai. But when I pray it's let's be able to find a straight to the point. Alright. So only the elect is gonna get this truth, man. Okay? Only the elect is gonna get this truth. Because two thirds they're not gonna get it. Alright? Two thirds continue to scoff, they continue to mock at this truth. Alright? Alright? So only the elect is gonna get this truth. So without further ado, let's get let's get the scriptures, man. Alright? Let's get the scriptures. Alright, I ain't gonna make this too long. This is Sirach Ecclesiastes 39, verse 24. It reads, As his ways are plain unto the holy, so are they stumbling blocks unto the wicked. They're stumbling blocks unto the wicked because the wicked can't obtain it, man. All right? The Lord Yahweh does not deal in a malicious soul. Okay? So it's a stumbling block unto the wicked. It's a stumbling block to Esau and him. It's a stumbling block to the heathen nations. And his truth is even a stumbling block to two-thirds of our own people. Okay? So, two-thirds are not going to get it, all right? Why? Because it wasn't meant for them to get it, all right? So, without further ado, let's move on, okay? This is Romans 11 and verse 7, and it reads, What then? Israel have not obtained that which he seeketh for, but the election have obtained it. Only the elect is going to get this truth, man, okay? Only the elect is going to be called into the truth. The Lord Yahweh he didn't want everybody. He didn't want all Israel on this uh, on this time, okay? Because in the past, all Israel got saved. But this time, only only a remnant, only elect are going to be saved in this time. And two-thirds are going to die on this side, pertaining to Zechariah chapter 13, verse 8 and 9, okay? Romans 11 and 7 again. What well, then, Israel have not attained that which he seeketh for, but the election have attained it, and the rest were blinded, Okay? The rest, two-thirds of our people, they're blinded. That's why they come up against this truth. That's why they fight against this truth. That's why they say that all nations can't be saved, including Esau, Edom. All right? That's why they come up against the men of the Lord so hard. Why? Because, hey, it wasn't given to them to understand. Okay? Verse 8. According as it is written, Yahweh had given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear, until this day. All right? Two thirds didn't get it then, all right, and they ain't getting it now, okay. It wasn't meant for them to get it, okay. Like I say, only the elect is gonna wake up to this truth, okay. Verse 9 And David said, Let that table be made a snare and a trap and a stumbling block and a reproach, it's like and a recompense unto them. Let their eyes be darkened that they may not see and, and bow down their backs away. Okay, so, hey, even King David prayed for the two-thirds to not get this truth. Okay, so, hey, two-thirds are not going to get it on this side, man. All right, so no matter how many scriptures you bring out with the two-thirds, they're just not going to get it. This wasn't meant for them to get it. Okay, all right. Uh, let's see. Because two-thirds, they're going to die on this side anyway, so, hey. You know, and like it's like it reads in uh, Zach, not Zechariah, but uh, Ezekiel the ninth chapter, if they ain't got that for why that mark of exemption, which is the truth, man. Hey, you're gonna be destroyed, okay? Excuse me, Zechariah chapter 13, verse 8. Um, I'll start verse 7. Awake, O sword, my against my shepherd and against the man that is my fellow, said the Lord Yahweh, you shall host. Smite the shepherd and the sheep shall be scattered, and I will turn my hand upon the little one. Verse 8. And it shall come to pass that in all the lands, said the Lord Yahweh, two parts therein shall be cut off and die, but the third shall be left therein. Only one third is going to be left, man, and that's a small number. Two thirds, that's a big number, right? So you're going to have a lot of our people that's going to die on this side, man. They're going to have to go through that death by pain. Because they either don't want to get the truth, or they don't want to hear the truth, okay? 
verse 9. And I will bring the third part through the fire, and will refine them as silver is refined, and will try them as gold is tried. And they should call upon my name, and I, and I will hear them. I will say, it is my people, and they shall sing, the Lord Yahweh Shai is my power. Okay? So only the elect is going to call on the names, the true names. All right? Not calling on Jesus Christ. Not calling on these other names, man. Okay? All right? <clears throat> this is Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 1, and verse 4. It says, For unto a malicious soul, wisdom shall not enter, nor dwell in the body that is subject unto sin. Okay? So this wisdom, this knowledge is not going to enter into a malicious soul, all right? Into a malicious two-thirds that is subject unto sin, point blank period, man, okay? All right, let's read this again. Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 1, and verse 4 again. For, un for into a malicious soul, wisdom shall not enter, nor dwell, nor dwell in the body that is subject unto sin, for the Holy Spirit of discipline will flee deceit and remove from thoughts that are without understanding and will not abide with righteousness. Unrighteousness cometh in. Okay, so there you go. So, hey, only this wisdom is going to enter into the righteous. Okay, it ain't going to enter into the soul of malicious spirit. All right. Point blank period. Let's get this. Isaiah 6 and verse 8. Also I heard a, heard the voice of the Lord Yahweh saying, Who shall I send, and who will I get for us? Then said I, Here I am, here am I, send me. And he said, Go, and tell this people, Hear ye indeed, but understand not, and see ye indeed, but perceive not. Verse 10, the point. Make the heart of this people fat, and the eyes of and make their ears heavy. Shut their eyes, lest they see with their eyes, and hear with their ears, and understand with their hearts, which means your mind, and convert and be healed. Okay? So, the Lord Yahweh got angels that are blocking your understanding. From here, it's true. Okay? So, hey, like I said, the deceiver and the deceiver are his. Okay? All right? Like it says, bless all your eyes for the seeing, bless all your ears for the hear. All right. So if you understand this truth and you get this truth, hey, you're blessed. Okay. You better consider yourself blessed. Okay. And hey, try to do something with this truth, man. Okay. Mm, let's move on. All right. Let's get this. This is John chapter 14, verse 17. Even the spirit of truth. Whom the world cannot receive, because it seeth him not, neither knoweth him, but ye know him, for he dwelleth in with you, and he sh and shall be in you. Okay, so the world cannot receive this truth. Two thirds of our people cannot receive this truth. All right, because they don't know the glory of Shai. Two thirds of our people, they don't know the glory of Shai. Like it says in John ten, and verse, let's get it. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna start at verse twenty-five. John ten twenty-five. Yahweh shall answer them. I told you, and ye believe not the works that I do in my Father's name. They bear witness of me, but ye believe not because ye are not of my sheep, as I as I sent unto you. All right. So those who didn't believe. Okay, they weren't of the Lord's sheep. They weren't of the elect. Okay, all right. Verse 27, my sheep hear my voice and I know them and they follow me. So only the elect is going to hear this truth and they're going to follow the Lord. How about she out shot wherever he goes? Okay, verse 28, and I give unto them eternal life and they shall never perish. Neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand. So you're not going to be able to pluck the elect out of the Lord's hand, man. Okay, you're not going to be able to pluck the Lord's elect out of his hand. Okay, verse 29. My father which gave me, gave them me is greater than all, and no man is able to pluck them out of my father's hand. Okay, so there you go. All right. Only the elect man is going to get this truth. 
right? Isaiah 45 and verse 4. For Jacob, my servant's sake, and Israel, my elect, I have even called thee by thy name. I have surnamed thee, though thou hast not known me. All right. So, hey, only the elect is going to contain this truth. All right. You didn't choose the Lord. The Lord, Yahweh, how shy chooses you. Okay. You don't choose the Lord. Uh, let's see. This is John chapter 15 and verse 16. Ye have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordained you that ye should go and bring forth fruit and that your fruit shall remain that who that whatsoever ye shall ask of the Father in my name, he may give it you. Okay, so the Lord did. So, hey, you didn't choose the Lord. The Lord chooses you. Okay, all right. So. There you go. Um, mm, mm, uh, I'm going to end it right here, man. All right. So I'm going to end the lesson here. I pray this lesson was edifying. I just wanted to get straight to the point, man. All right. So, hey. All right. Like it says, his ways are plain to the homely, so they stumbling blocks to the wicked. Okay. All right. So, hey. I don't know what I'm going to call this lesson, though, but. Nevertheless, Lord willing, I pray this lesson was edifying. All praises to you, Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, Hashem, Rakakadash, Double Gun, City Elves, and the Apostles, a great millstone who taught me is true. And double side taste to tell you, Akim, the men that are prophesying and named throughout the four winds of this earth, listen to the truth with their righteousness and sincerity. See you with another lesson soon, Lord One, Kwam Yashiran, Shan One, Wai Baba Bog, about One, BTA, Destruction of Babylon, the Great America. Boom! We almost out of here, brothers and sisters. Hang tight. Show on.